All right, how do we avoid frustration at home? So building pretty straightforward, but how do we do it at home? Well, here's an example. It's dinner time and the kids are starving, but it's not going to be ready for another 45 minutes. So the, you know, the kids emotionally attach themselves to, I am starving, I wanna eat right now, and I'm going to act out on everyone around me. Well, instead we can focus on other things. Let's go ahead and set the table. Let's be a part of the process and support maybe the chef doing all the cooking. I have some extra homework that I can get done right now. I can accomplish, you know, I can hit two more questions in math. And so I'm ready after dinner and I've eliminated two of those questions. So those are the things we do instead of tying ourselves to, you know, to the emotionally tying ourselves to the result we want, which is I'm starving. Go ahead, do some other things, make yourself productive, figure out your strategy and know that in 45 minutes, you're going to be eating the most amazing dinner ever.